What's happening, my film friends? David the Film Junkie here oh, with a third video of the night. Yeah, I'm on a roll today, guys. But just, everybody talking about their movies, and I love it when they talk about their movies. It gets me excited, gets you excited. That's why I like to talk about it. And uh, this time, this is on the Marvel side. Yes, we're still very jazzed, of course, about the whole, you know, the whole addition of Spider-Man possibly crossing over into this world, and that's just fine and dandy. Ah, oh, it still could happen, folks. It's still in the cards. We'll see what happens in January. Apparently they have something in January that they're going to announce what they're going to do with the Spider-Man franchise. Sony Pictures is going to announce and hopefully they just go, hey, guess what guys? He's going to be in Captain America Civil War and then Avengers Affinity Wars oh, oh, and then a whole new group of movies. Oh. Alright, sorry. I just kind of creamed in my pants but that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about James Gunn and his Guardians of the Galaxy. Of course, that movie was just fantastic. One of the best of the year. It's a blockbuster that just had everything that we just loved and, you know, nobody knew what, what it was going to have, you know. Um, and then now everybody, after that, everybody started thinking, okay, when are they crossing over with the Avengers? Oh, man, when's that going to happen? Infinity Wars? Yeah, hopefully, yeah. I want to see Star-Lord speak with freaking Tony Stark and have him go back and forth, you know. Jeez, that would just, the Hulk and Groot, oh, hey, that'd be something. Well, don't get your hopes up too much there, gang, okay? Because there's a, there's, there's a chance that it might not really happen. And I even thought, too, when I thought about that aspect of it, I'm like, okay, are they going to bring everybody together? Just two big groups of fucking, you know, of superheroes, really? Well, kind of superheroes, I guess. Guardians of the Galaxy aren't exactly superheroes. They're more like misfits that are just together. I mean, they have their abilities, of course. But they really are just like... The Misfit Avengers, you can really compare them. I, I remember, I think it was the uh, Honest Trailer, which is a very good Honest Trailer. Um, uh, they talked about, <laughs> it was an Honest Trailer for Guardians, and they compared each one to each of the Avengers. So, you know, it would be awesome to see. I'm not saying that I would not want to see it, but it just seems like it would be just too much almost too much like i was going man that movie would just be outrageous that the budget on that would be like a billion dollars maybe half a billion at least but this is what james gunn had to say about guardians of the galaxy crossing over with the avengers he said we are we are separate from the avengers and i don't think people should assume too many things about the guardians play in all of these okay we have our own galaxy to take care of we have our own galaxy to save earth is the avengers province thinking that everything is going to come together in a perfect way is not necessarily the way it's going to happen okay so now he's not exactly dismissing the fact you know there still might be maybe something could happen you never know the end of infinity wars everybody just comes together to defeat thanos Maybe, because everybody, you know, when it comes down to it, the Avengers and the Guardians of the Galaxy do have that common villain that is Thanos, and we don't know what he's up to because every time we've seen him, it's always been very short. Well, it's only been twice, really. It's been very short, so we don't know what's going on, and, you know, we well, we kind of know what's going on. We know he wants, he wants that Infinity Gauntlet, and he wants to wear that fucking glove, you know, he wants to wear it and just control everything and just conquer everything and just be the king of the whole freaking universe but um you know it's it, it that, that's not going to be an easy task i mean i'm sure it's hard enough just to have it was hard enough just to bring the avengers together and now we're you're talking about all these other players you're talking about new avengers the guardians of the galaxy hell even the inhumans i mean there's so many levels that marvel has gone and it just would be a fucking huge clusterfuck and very difficult just to bring them all together so don't so don't get too excited you know at the, the possibility of it james gunn is not exactly dismissing it but you know you know just don't get too excited i mean I, i'm not dwelling on it. i'm not going i'm not saying oh fuck why you know fuck you guys marvel sucks and i'm not thinking that at all i'm thinking it, it this is it takes a lot to make these movies and just to have like two big you know movie teams come together that's that could be rather difficult especially with these actors and their <laughs> you know and their schedules and it's just crazy but let me know what you think about that below are you disappointed that there might not be a guardians of the galaxy and avengers crossover are you okay with it do you hate it you know just let me know what you think about it down below in the balls there also hit that like thumbs up button if you'd be so kind subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i will talk to you guys later